Two exciting matches against Torino see us through to the round of 16 in the Europa League after an exciting penalty shootout. And as we get to the back end of the season, how far can the Tigers make it? <laughs> hey, welcome back. It's Respect the Jeff here with episode 54 of this whole city career. And things are really heating up at this stage. Guys, if you've been enjoying this series so far, please subscribe to the channel and we will move forwards. Um, some notifications there, but we got two games in the league before we get back to Europa League action. And just to take a quick check in here, we got Aston Villa up next. They are doing horrendous this season, so it's a good opportunity for us. So I might rotate this squad a little bit and just taking a look ahead, we've drawn Ajax in the next round of the Europa League. That is going to be a huge matchup for this team. Uh, we got two league games sandwiched in between those, so we'll play those this episode. And then next, we will focus on getting those wins in the Europa League. Um, the squad's looking really tired, guys. We need to rotate a little bit here. Um, I'm not really sure who to put in. Allen can get some minutes, and you know what? If we're going to play these players against anybody. It might as well be against a team like Aston Villa. So Castro gets in the starting 11. Um, the rest of the squad more or less unchanged. I don't want to weaken things too much. Bello at left back just to get some more minutes. And that's our team for this game and let's get to it. All right guys, here we go. We line up against Aston Villa. They've been in horrendous form. So I really, really hope we can grab three points here. A little bit of rotation in the side. I want to see how Castro can play at defensive mid. Definitely not the highest rated in our squad, but like I said, if he's going to get minutes against anybody, surely it's got to be a team like this. Allen, and here's Castro getting involved already. Ball out wide with Maroya. Patient with our play here. Oh, and Bowen giving that one away very poorly. Target with a good touch. Finding himself in behind our lines now. Good defending, though. Ball put in. Oh, it's a great first touch. Settled down. Burke, right place, right time. Makes the interception. And now we spring the other way. Allen through the middle. Bowen. He's got some options. Tony. Good flick through. Allen. Ito. Oh, should have taken it himself. He went for the first time pass. Good idea, but wasn't there. And now Aston Villa regaining possession, but some good defensive work by Bello. Sees us win that ball back. And the pressure remains on now. Sutar, Maroya, Castro, Allen. Ah, again, given away very poorly. Some mistakes there. Castro. Oh, getting in behind. It's another touch through our lines. Good defending by Sutar. But it's back up to the top of the box now. Jota. Putting a ball in, Fabricio snatches that one out of the air. And now it's wide with Okugawa. Allen. And our midfield just doesn't look the same without our usual starting line in there. But it doesn't matter, the ball is through anyways. It's Ito in a lot of space here. What can he do? Ito cutting it back for Bowen. It's a goal. Well, that is so well done from the winger. He stayed composed on it. And he makes the most of his dribbling abilities there. Absolutely leaves his man for dead and sets that one up for our captain. Aston Villa looking to get right back in this match. Ball over the top. Bello there to cover. But it's a nice cutback. And out on the wing again. Bello doing his best. And he does succeed. Good tackle from the left back. He's looked pretty sharp. And it's nice to have an option like him waiting in the substitute ranks there. Castro on it now. He's been pretty solid, Castro. Nothing outstanding, but definitely a reliable player. He does get his head up and pick out a good pass for Bowen there. Jared Bowen, oh, a little too much on the ball. And he, on the other hand, has not looked very sharp tonight, Bowen. Giving the ball away a couple times and hasn't really had a look at goal. But with a player of his quality, what are you going to do? Sometimes we have off nights. Putting a ball in and it's headed away. Good defensive work there. Aston Villa. Really growing in confidence here. Okugawa looking to cut that pass out, but he's unsuccessful. Target picking it up. Cutting it back. Great piece of skill. Back to the top of the box now. Settles. 
And another clever through ball, Aston Villa playing very well right now, but Castro again there to intercept, so well done. And the whistle blows, we take it to halftime with a one goal lead. We kick off the second half here, Aston Villa with possession to start. Top of the box. Defending deep, a pass through our lines. Ooh, we're lucky there with a weak shot at the end of the move. Aston Villa seems like with every passing play, they get a little sharper. And I am getting worried here. We got to keep a hold of our lead. This would be a huge victory. Or rather, it would be a poor loss for the team if we blew it here. Aston Villa picking that ball up again, though. Giving away very sloppily. Castro picking it up. Finds Tony up top. Ivan Tony with the nutmeg pass to find Maroya out on the wings. The return. Tony up top for Castro. Not rushing things here. Oh, looking for the ball through, but it is booted away by that tough Aston Villa defense. And Bello with the overhead pass there. A little unnecessary, maybe, but we do keep a hold of possession regardless. Tony. Ah, looking to split the lines there. It's a poor pass from Tony, though. He's been okay today, but as usual, he just, I don't know, he just lacks a little something, Tony. Definitely not a bad player by any stretch, but not really lighting the world on fire either. Aston Villa again with possession. We can't get anything going up top right now. Allen looking to cover. I think we need a switch in midfield with Higita and Stewart both out. The defensive work just isn't the same. We don't seem to be able to win the ball back, and it's a dangerous cross into the box. Oh, I thought that was in just wide. All right, substitution time now. I'm actually going to put Sutar in defensive mid. Just lock things down in there. Uh, Gonzalez in the back line. And while we're at it, uh, we need Ito fresh for our next game. So I'm going to bring on Corioso, the new signing. Let's see if he can impress us. He's another one that I figure if he doesn't get minutes against teams like this, then he won't get minutes at all. So let's give him an opportunity to get out there and impress. Burke on the ball now. Not a lot of options. Corioso, though, getting involved. Clever touch through. And he finds the return pass. Good run from the young striker. And again, finds Sutar running through. Sutar cutting inside. Has a go himself. And it's the center back turn defensive mid. Enjoying getting forward there. And just has a shot at goal. Not too bad, but his finishing lacks. Finding our way through now. Well played out from the back. Okugawa. The return to Allen. Allen gets his head up over the top. Corioso using his speed in behind. We know that's a great attribute of his. Cutting inside, and he might have a look at goal now. Corioso deflected off of the center back. It's been a bright start from our young striker here out on the wing. He's a fantastic dribbler and very quick. Definitely not the most well rounded player right now, but we're seeing what he can do on the ball for sure. There he is again, Corioso. Finds the man in Sutar. It's Bello now. Looking for the return. Corioso trying to beat his man, and he does somehow. Still dancing through the lines. Oh, no. Corioso walks his way through their back line. Has a shot at goal. It's a good save in the end. But what an impressive start. It's a throw in now. Bello, Corioso. Little step over there. He loves the flair, this young player. He's looked really bright so far. Tony, flick through for Allen. Looking for the return pass. A little too far, though. Corioso picking it up. Ah, but unable to settle. Trying to win that ball back. But the whistle blows, and we come away with a very narrow victory. But a victory nonetheless. All three points heading in our direction. And some bright spots to take away. Corioso looked impressive, and so did Castro. And we are really building for the future. All right, well, moving on now, it's Norwich up next, our old team from FIFA 19 for those who followed that career. It's always a joy to play against former sides. And a transfer offer coming in for Burke. Very good value, too. You know what? He's been unhappy, and he's voiced that several times this season. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and accept it. We can find a new center back for next season if we do continue this career. Uh, but he's just not getting many minutes anyways. Maybe we can bring in someone who's a little more promising. He's been a good player, don't get me wrong, but he's not going to be starting over Gonzalez and Sutar the way that they have been performing. Um, so I guess we're just going to have to send 
a scout out to start looking for replacements here. Uh, we got plenty of time on the bright side. He won't leave until the end of the season if this deal goes through, so there's really no rush there. He can come off the bench as needed still. Like I said, we got Norwich up next. Going to rotate the squad a little bit once again. Um, really, none of these players, I think, need to get involved. It'll probably just be our usual starting 11. Lopez back on the wing just to get some minutes. But aside from that, it remains the same. All right, guys, here we go away at Caro Road. Our old stomping grounds here with Norwich. And it is Norwich who have the ball to start. And let's see what we can do out here. Getting in behind Batshuayi. No support ahead of him, though. But dancing through, it's Tom Tribal. Cutting back inside now. But we force them all the way back. Good defending from the team. Norwich getting forwards again. But we're not leaving them with a lot of space here, Tribal. Oh, played through! It's a weak shot wide. Twisting and turning, finds Kelly out on the wing. And it's Ito now. Tatsuya Ito, oh, good defending by Sam Byram. Almost beats his man there, the Japanese winger. But he is unable to find his way through. It's out on the wing again. Tribal had a lot of the ball so far, and Norwich with a lot of the possession. Finding the return pass. Not a lot to show for it, though. A very good tackle from Higita, and that's the defensive mid-efforts that we know and love. Back in action here. Forwards now with Ito. Good pass from Higita. Bowen. Oh, nice ball through for Lopez. What can he do here? Leonardo Lopez cuts it back for Kubo. And that is beautiful stuff from the team. End to end. And just making the right decisions. Not sure what's going on there with the celebration. And no replay either, apparently. But a very good goal from the team, nonetheless. And it's been a bright start from our side. Running in behind now. Stewart again. Finding his way through. Kubo! Oh, one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. And almost again. Well, you love to see those kind of moves from the team. It's good stuff from Kubo. And really just a good save in the end. Maybe could have tucked it a little farther into the corner there. But it's a bright run anyways. Bowen, Ito, back to Bowen, back to Ito again. Good link up play there. And it's Ito, oh, beautiful cross. But no one making that run. He put it right across the line. Bowen with some step overs, lets it get a little too far in front of him. And the ball booted away. And we just continue the pressure here, good stuff. In the middle now for Bowen. He's got some options. Bowen to Ito. What can he do here? Over the top. Great pass. Bowen goes with the head. Probably could have settled that one and had a shot, but he's high in confidence right now. Maybe he thought he could finish that one. And Ito setting him up well again. It's been a really good look from our entire front line this game. Ah, a little too far in front of Higita. Ito, it's through for Kelly, using his speed and strength to get in behind. And an early ball for Kubo. Oh, that is a fantastic cross. Lopez, Bowen, Maroya. Good start to the second half here. It's Lopez running in behind and he finds Kubo! <laughs> Just wide of the post. That is a fantastic opportunity. Put the early ball in. And I guess it looked a little closer than it actually was. Bashuai trying to find a way through, but again, no support for him, although he does receive the return pass. And a fantastic tackle from Sutar sees that one out. Playing through the middle now, Bowen, amazing flick there. And we are just flying high up top. Kubo, oh, great move through, trying to pick out Bowen. Right idea, wrong execution. Sutar, out there to cover Batshuayi. Tribo picking the ball up. Trying to find an option forwards, McLean. Finds his way through again. Good interception there from our back line once again. And now we break in the other direction. Uh, but the ball given away poorly. Norwich with the possession again. Trying to get it forwards, but it's Maroya making the smart interception. Good covering from the right back. And he finds the return pass there. Maroya surging forwards. What can he do here? Maroya putting it in over the head of Kubo. All right, substitutions now. Bowen and Ito rested. 
for our upcoming game against Ajax. It's Tony and Corioso who impressed in the last game. Coming back on to get some minutes here. And we just got to lock things down. Make sure we come away with the result here. That's Lopez from the corner. Played short. Ah, oh, poor ball. Forwards now with Corioso. Some good footwork and he plays a fantastic pass through for Tony. Good stuff from the youngster. Oh, cutting it back. Wrong decision from Tony there. A little too unselfish perhaps. Just look good again. Ah, Corioso this time does give the ball away. Challenged very hard in the center of midfield there. Norris getting the ball forward. 83rd minute. Just got to hang on for a few more. Stewart giving away a foul. Norris playing out from the back. Outrageous touch from Todd Cantwell. He hasn't seen too much of the ball, but he's always skillful. We do know that much. Oh, and a flick over Tony sliding in. Great stuff from Norwich, but no end product to show for it. 91st minute now. Allen covering Cantwell out on the wings. It's McLean. Ball into the box. Kelly is there to make the interception. Hegita takes that one off from the back, but we hang on to a win as the whistle blows. And it's another 1-0 victory. But it doesn't matter in the end. Three points more for this team, and we look to be safe from relegation at this point. All right, guys, there you have it. Some good performances from the team, and Aaron's not happy with his playing time. Well, he should have done better earlier in the season when he got opportunities then. The team looks good without him at this point. And we have Ajax up next, guys. Don't miss next episode. It's going to be a very exciting one for sure as we face off against the European Giants. So I'll be back soon with that. But until then, I'm Respect the Jeff, and I'll see you next time.